Horizon Zero Dawn is getting a new game, but it's not Horizon 3. Now, Horizon Zero Dawn is arguably one of the best single-player games of this generation. But hold on a second before I get into the news. You know, subscribe, like the video, the usual stuff. Now, as I said, you know, Horizon, amazing game. Then they release Horizon Forbidden West. And people like to hype this game up as, like, the most underrated game of all time. The game is garbage. The aliens and the superheroes don't cut it for me, I've ruined the canon. So I'm kind of glad they're doing something Horizon based which isn't a sequel to that trash game. And you know, Horizon Zero Dawn, you know, you could even do a prequel, you could do a lot of stuff on it. I know they wanted to do a TV show at one point, you know, flipping like Netflix original series or whatever. I wouldn't have watched it because Netflix are gay. So let me give you guys the rundown of the Horizon Zero Dawn spin-off sequel thing that might be happening. And it's multiplayer by the way. A reputable insider claims that Guerrilla Games may release the long-rumoured Horizon multiplayer project before the third mainline entry in the series. So let me just give my thoughts here on the fact that there might be a Horizon multiplayer game, right? Because they could actually do some cool things with this, okay? Imagine you've got like 40 people in a lobby, right? Everyone's going around with bow and arrows or whatever, and they're on like these robo-dinosaurs and whatever, and they're just shooting each other, they're flipping enemy teams, maybe there's two teams, maybe there's three teams, like different tribes or whatever. You've got different types of guns. You might have like some tribe that have got guns, some that got bows, some that got, I don't know, flipping fishing rods, and like it could actually be fun. On the other side of things, they there could be this whole situation where everyone wants to be playing as Aloy so it's kind of just like oh well you know everybody can play as Aloy and you've got Aloy 1, Aloy 2 and the only difference between all of them would just be they have different coloured hairstyles imagine that you've got Aloy with flipping pink hair now this would be a really horrible idea for a game and if Guerrilla Games are watching this video and they actually take this into account please do not take anything I say seriously other than the times when I'm meant to be taken seriously now there's some more news I've got to talk about in a little bit, but what I want to just talk about real quick here, right, is the fact that, you know, there's a lot of single player games out here that release a single player, okay, you see it with like Assassin's Creed Black Flag or whatever, The Last of Us, and they just don't thrive, okay, they just kind of just die off, and then there's no content supported for it, and it's just like, bro, who even cares? Now, the fact is with this Horizon online game, I presume that it's not going to be a part of actual, like an a main game like a third installment for the horizon series and that it's actually going to be its own separate thing so they could just make it like you know free to play like they do for most games you know you've got all these different skins and everything tons of different weapons now as i said if this is like a giant battlefield style thing maybe you have like the fight over meridian or whatever and you know you can play as different tribes there and everything uh, like, it could actually be really good and kind of have it like Battlefront 2, where like the maps and the modes tie into the canon moments and you get to play as all these different characters, which you may have not even seen in like the Battle Meridian, for example. Now, there's been like 16 Horizon projects, which, you know, some of them have been cancelled, some of them haven't been. And I didn't even realise, but this online Horizon multiplayer game, right, uh, you know, apparently has been in the talks of Guerrilla Games since 2022. So there's definitely a few years that have been put into it, right? But the fact that there's been so many projects in the Horizons universe that have literally just been cancelled out of the blue, like, I know we're getting the Lego Adventures Horizon Zero Dawn game or something like that, right? And that game nobody cares about, okay? That's going to be flipping awful. Like, who cares about flipping a Lego Horizon? But, like, releasing a Horizon Zero Dawn flipping multiplayer game, like, it's a huge risk, okay? And, you know, I'm not sure if people are really going to be with it. You know, it depends. It could be amazing and, you know, maybe a lot of people are going to play it. Like, if it's free to play, I might even play it, okay? Right? As long as they keep out of the Forbidden West style stuff, right? Then, you know, I'll be happy. What do you guys think, though? You know, are you happy with the fact that, you know, there could be a Horizon multiplayer game releasing before the third installment? Or do you not really care about Horizon? Or are you really excited for the third game because you're a loser? You know, let me know. Um, but I know most of you guys are cool and realize the Forbidden West is total trash. So, uh, yeah, this has kind of been a ramp, like, flipping about Horizon Forbidden West. I can't even speak. I'm going now. See you later. Have a good rest of your evening.